Okay, so let's talk about that DPU versus DAP real quick. I've got a question here and it says that we ship to South Korea using DAP Incoterms and we recently came across a problem where warehouse charges came into the question. Would DPU be a better option so to solve us of any warehouse changes that might incur and pass that on to my buyer? I'd like to know which warehouse we're talking here. Is it, a, is it your actual, I guess it's the actual buyer's warehouse. And that's uh, what it would appear to. Okay. Well, if you're selling on a DAP term, uh, then any charges at the warehouse, really you, you're responsible to just get it there. You know, they're responsible to get it unloaded. Uh, you know, it, actually it says right there, it's negotiable. So it's between the buyer or the seller, you know, opposed to DPU where it's up to the seller to get it unloaded. So if you have some costs for, for warehousing, you know, on a DAP term, that's just something you want to address and, and see if you can figure out, you know, who's got to pay for it. I would not want to pay for somebody else's warehouseman. You know, I don't, you know, I don't know the going rate over there and I wouldn't want to be involved in it uh, at the end of the day. That's, but that's obviously my opinion.